Dan Walker is usually more at home, of course, on the breakfast sofa, but his partner, Nadia, <laughs> is certainly helping him find his dancing feet. Well, oh. congratulations. <laughs> we loved it. We were with Craig. Yeah. We loved it, Dan. And welcome. Lovely to see you as well, Nadia. Um, well, Dan, who knew? Did you even know that you had that in you? <laughs> I, my wife asked me about three weeks before the competition started. Now she said, can you actually dance properly? I said, I don't really know. So when, when Anton said, I thought you'd be awful on that first week, we did the quick dance, uh, the quick step. Um, I, I, I felt like saying, so did I. Um, I, was, I was as surprised as anybody else. But in all honesty, Nadia is absolutely amazing. And I'm, I feel like I'm learning so much from her. And um, if you'd have told me two weeks ago that I'd have danced a quick step, and danced to Pastor Domino and got sort of mid 20s points for both of them off those four judges. I would have gone, get in the bin. That's absolute rubbish. I can't do that. But you're, you are, you know, you're somehow finding something in there. Yeah, but you're amazing. I mean, he works so hard and I, he hardly sleeps by <laughs> waking up at 3 a.m. But then every day he comes to rehearsals and gives me his 100% every time. But he did fall asleep yesterday again just, on just the there. floor. <laughs> Dan, I've got to ask you, the f week one, you've got a great suit on, not surprising that, that choice of outfit. Week two, Paso Doble in that gladiator outfit. Were you channeling Russell Crowe or what? <laughs> I, I was, I went full Russell Crowe. And I said to Nadia, yeah, how do you show joy in a Paso Doble? Because in a quick step, you can sort of smile and be a bit of a goo. And she said to me that before we went on, she wanted me to get fully into character. So we actually just stared at each other um, for about a minute, didn't we, before we Even went more, on? Even more, I think. Yeah, and that, I think that's why I dragged her off at the end and shouted at everyone else, are you not entertained? I, I could, once I got into the character, I found it quite hard to come out of it. <laughs> <laughs> actually, Dan, it's so diverse from what you do every morning. I mean, you have to be very serious in the morning with the news, and your family would be used to watching you doing that. So what do they think now of this new dad and this new husband? Oh, Gloria, they, they are absolutely loving it. Um, and also, they're really enjoying getting to know Nadia a bit. The first day we trained in Sheffield, there they are, um, we, she came round for dinner, she met my wife and my three children. It was my kids, really, who persuaded me to do Strictly Come Dancing. They wanted, um, they said, can you, we'd love you to do some telly, Dad. We'd love you to do Saturday Mashup and Strictly. So I did Saturday Mashup and then I agreed to do Strictly. But I, I genuinely thought, I'll do it for a couple of weeks, I'll be terrible and then I can go home. Um, but I've really, really enjoyed it. And I know you'd expect me to say this because she sat next to me, but this woman is incredible i mean to be able to dance and to learn from somebody who's a you know double world champion european champion basically the best dancer on the planet for her to be able to teach me how to sort of flounce around the dance floor i i, I can't believe how privileged i feel to do that and you've really she's she's become a bit part of our family as well i am yeah. I, I just saw well, i'm going yeah coming around for dinner yeah. tonight yeah and also, Such a beautiful family, and people they love it as well. Mm. So it's beautiful. And to talking of your family, Dan, funny, we were talking about you. We d we ended up doing a topic because of something you'd said about uh, your faith and that you didn't want to work on Sundays and that you devote that um, day to your family. I don't know if you you even heard that we had been talking about that. Um, but that, I did see that. Thank yeah, you. I mean that is something very close to your heart, though, isn't it? Yeah, and I, can I say thank you because often. People look at that and treat it really negatively. Um, but you, I think you did it really sensitively. And um, you know, the way that I, I look at it is I work really hard six days a week. And um, you know, my sister's a, a nurse in intensive care. She works on a Sunday, but it's a choice that I made a long time ago to try and set that day aside to spend um, with my family and the church and doing things slightly differently. And it's not something that works for everybody, but it really works for me. And I think it gives me really good perspective. And my kids know that wherever I am doing busy stuff all over the place, I'll, I'll be there on a Sunday and that'll be a day that we spend together as a family. And no one that strictly ever does anything on a Sunday anyway, so it's not like I'm missing out on anything. But um, yeah, for me, it, it's what helps to make me tick and keep me going. And um, I'm not had any demands from Nadia to be involved on a Sunday yet, so we'll see what happens. <laughs> uh, um, Dan, very quickly, and Nadia, can you give us any kind of hint or indeed tell us what your dance is going to be next weekend? Absolutely. Yeah, now reveal. we can, yeah, big reveal. It's Sleeping Beauty. Oh. Uh, she, she's Sleeping Beauty. Just <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be a print. 
Actually, Nadia, I love the way you've settled into... It's beautiful. Into... Not, not Sorry, Gloria. I, I love the way you've settled into Sheffield. I gather that they've really taken you to their hearts in that time. Love Sheffield, absolutely, yeah. Yeah, yeah but we've been out for a curry. Um, there's a, just behind us here, there's a garage next door for where we train. And they've, they've big, got a big sign in the window saying, good luck, Dan and Nadia. And there's actually a Ukrainian flag in there as well now. <laughs> we can, I think we can also tell you what song we're, we're dancing to as well, can't we? Can you sing it? OK. Um, so it's, it's from Sleeping Beauty seconds, and it's a Dan. bit of a fox. Ten box. seconds. Goes like this. Ten seconds. I know you, I walk with you once. Upon a dream. Oh, yeah. Fox. <laughs> Love that. Oh, Dan, we're going to have to leave it. You know what it's like. Hard count. Good luck on Saturday. Bye-bye. <laughs>